Hey dudes, we're back! Hi! We got Splatterhouse from NEC on the uh, the NEC Turbo Duo. It's uh it's a Turbo Graphics 16 and Turbo Graphics 16 Super CD Hybrid CD Hybrid. My mother got me. I love my mom. Uh, it's Friday the thirteenth. So we're gonna start by playing Splatterhouse. Uh, we've got uh, Fuzzy here, Fuzzy Ski, uh, also known as known as Adam, uh, Adam Pierce. I'm also actually a goat. He's actually Don't a goat on by Twitter. Twitter. Yeah. So uh, we also have Akash the car, who's washing his hands after eating some pomelo, but putting it away sadly. Uh, I am going to. We're gonna play lives and levels. I'm gonna let those guys play until I have a few more bites of this beast. And I'm gonna wash my hands. Um, but yeah. All right, so I haven't played this game since around the time the GameCube was coming out. I haven't played this game since 1994. But I'll, I'll tell you something really, really sad about this release that we have. The American release for this game, they took out the entire story. There were a story? There was actually a story to the game. Like, you, you're these kids, and you, you go to this house to escape something, and you're staying there for some reason, and all of a sudden the doctor captures you and your girlfriend, and she's gone, and you are turned into this horrible beast with this mask on. Oh! The mask that promises to help you, right? Something yes. along those lines? Yeah, I remember that. Wait, what? Yeah, yes. like the mask is sentient. You remember the story? Yeah, I do. Would you play this on another system? I played the original, then I played, I downloaded the Japanese version by mistake on an emulator. Oh, you were breaking the law. I was breaking the law. You were the lawbreaker. You can you can uh, email the government and say he copied that floppy. And, <laughs> he copied um, that floppy. Let them know. And they'll say what the fuck. <laughs> what so are you let's, talking get, about? let's get started, guys. Let's yeah. get some slaughterhouse rolling. Right. But this game genuinely scared me when I was little. It came out. Let's the watch year. it. Let's watch it. Yeah. So normally, that you would see them walk up to the house. You don't. do. We know why they didn't play this. I don't remember honestly, uh, but. You don't see them walk up to the house. You just see the house. <laughs> you see it, it for a long it's, time. It's for like 38 seconds. A long you just see guy. this house. That's, That's it. Dave um, asks, the mask is sentient, isn't it? Yes. Yes, it is. Arcadian Gaming says, I want to remind people that at one point, Sputter House had a sequel on newer gen consoles, and they had some amazing yeah. trends to remember release. Release. There's a way they are the best shoot. to slide yeah. across the yeah. ground here. Oh, did you? But I'm down to two hit points, so Alrighty. maybe I shouldn't sit here and try to remember how to do special moves. Happy Friday the 13th, everyone! There you go. Nice. How do you do that one? Um, you jump while moving in direction, you hit down, and right before you hit the ground, you press B. Wow. You mean two? Yes. One. One or two. Two. Before the Wii. Hey, I knew two. one of two buttons. Yeah. yeah. Citizen Cybertron says two college students, Rick Taylor and Jennifer Willis, take refuge from a storm in West Mansion, a local landmark known as Splatterhouse, for the rumors of hideous experiments purportedly conducted there by Dr. West, a renowned and missing psycho no, parapsychologist. Like, like Herbert West, reanimator. Played by Jeffrey Combs, who also played a large chunk of Talking Fungus in Motivational Growth, my feature film. Speaking of which, you said the mold was here. Yes. I want to meet the mold. Tell my apartment he's in a... I'll, I'll, I'll introduce you to him. He's, a, he's in a storage area down the hall. A cash hold me the fuck down. He's a beast. I don't know if you know this. I mean... What are the... I, I spent my no. first three hit points trying to remember a mechanic that I wasn't <laughs> even sure actually existed. But see, what, oh, God. Game. But watching you helped me. Okay, so you, this is the first boss. Yeah. yeah. If I remember, you just kill these maggots. Okay. Yeah, that's that's it. That you yeah. Each is. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. This <laughs> Have you played Spyhouse 3 on the Genesis? That game had a branching story. Wow. I did, depending on your actions, people would live or die. Incredible. And I got so traumatized when I did something and my wife in the game died that I actually returned the game early and never played it again. <laughs> That's incredible. Because I, I played it when I was like, what, like six? See, I, I got really excited a couple of years ago when they made um, a release of this for the newer console. Yeah, yeah, the, the remakes. Are and 
I got really excited because you could unlock the originals. Yes, which is super cool. And I went and I bought it on launch night, and I played it at, played it once and never touched it again. <laughs> yeah, it's not. So, it's the Citizen, greatest game of all Citizen time. Cyber John continues the lore. Rick awakens in a dungeon under the mansion to discover that he is still alive thanks to the influence of the Terror Mask. The Terror Mask! Uh, some version. However, it's the Hell Mask. Mask in the American version. A Mayan sacrificial artifact from the house which is capable of sentient thought. The mask attaches itself to Rick, fusing his body and transforming him into a monster with superhuman strength. This would be a good movie to make. Someone would be interested. Yeah. And they're like, you're not Uwe Ball. We'll take it. We'll you're infinitely better. So! <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. In the, in the third game with that branching story, the mask gives you superpowers and you get super buff and ripped and can, like, punch things through walls. Like this. Oh, does that happen? You're super time? buffed and ripped. No, no, no. He gets even buffer. I remember when I was a kid. Not, not ever as an adult. Because I haven't played the game. When I was a kid, Go. I would point up on a level just to make it look like he was pissing on the wall. Like, <laughs> yeah. It's kind of. It's kind of Because if I was kidnapped in a house, that's the first thing I would do. I'd this is like, the biggest ass house ever. ever. It's like Resident Evil 1. Yeah. Did you? Oh. oh. Alright. Yeah. Not yet, not yet. Oh. Music's incredible. This music's very interesting. We know the system's capable of better music. Absolutely, we know. Uh, Trip Tide says these old games can really be creepy at times. This old one, Ken Say Den on Master System. Uh, yeah. Old these these old indie games were yeah, and then shutters. Citizen Cybertron says. I love that the traditional life meter hearts were actually cardiac organs in the game. Yep. It's crossing. Great. I think that's the first time in the stream you've actually warned someone you were crossing. Is that true? As soon as it just gets faster and higher pitched. Now, if I remember right, this is the boss I can never get past. Uh, Alright, let's see if you can do it today. Do you not want to play? Um, I'm trying to fix, uh, finish up my page. Okay. You can dodge all of this uh, crap. Yeah. Is that and all you have to do? It starts flying at you. Oh, you have to kill the chair. I love how these monsters you can kill with one punch. With a chair. Yes. That's just... Four Chairs days. are the devil. Music. Ow. Oh, nice. <laughs> I'm gonna punch this knife. With my upper arm. Hey, oh. so oh. And they actually took out a lot of gore for the American release as well. Yeah. I'm, that I'm not surprised about. They, do we have to oh. play the game? Right, let's do it. It's been a while, but fucking. <laughs> Okay. Oh, I like it. Oh. It's been a while. Okay, never mind. Oh, nice. If you don't, if there are no enemies on the screen, that wrench will fly into the screen. I should go in. Like when you get to the end. Yeah, it'll, it'll, it'll just be sitting there. That's incredible. <laughs> you know, you have a fair I amount of like Spider-House. Or, or Tippets. Yeah. Wait, that just had you play it. it. It's it's no, it's not it's not so it's but it's not. Almost religiously much about his Ah, gotcha. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, let's listen to these sweet chants. So, Sezue has a question. Hmm. Got a question for you guys. Okay. Now that I'm reading some of the pledge tiers, will you end up rewriting some of the tiers to cut off loopholes? For example, enemy ships. Now, enemy ship will get everything above except for limited tiers, i.e., Star Citizen and Star Hero. Um, that's not true. That's not a loophole. Um, those tiers are limited. At that tier level, beyond that tier level, you get everything below. We have a graph down there explaining that. That's not a loophole. That's on purpose. If you if you pledge just at the star citizen level, you get the star citizen and it's limited. If you pledge above the star citizen level, you get the star citizen level as well. 
Even though it's limited, you get you, you actually get all the other stuff. That's on purpose. That's not a loophole. We think that if you're going to invest in us, you're going to get good stuff. And I'm not sure if they put the mechanic in the first one. But if you stand still for too long, this is not the ghost will start chasing oh, yeah. you through the game. I was definitely in the third one, from what I remember. So it might be this one. Why would you give him 12 million to Omega? Probably because like it was that 90s, early 90s era where like, yeah, yeah hardcore blood was like so in. Yeah. Triptide says, at least it's better than the loss of water in Metal Slug. I uh, I had I had the greatest like that right there, that thing where you hit the guy and he goes up against the back wall. That was a huge deal for me when I was a kid. This Very game, satisfying. Yeah, it was like, okay, this game's great now. Look at all that banding. <laughs> Alright, <laughs> do it, Adam. Fuck that chair up, bro. That's the worst chair. You're fighting the house itself. The splatter house. This is all just a pattern, too. Like, every single thing in this game is set into a pattern. Oh, it's yeah. the same every it's, time. Uh, I think the final boss is the only thing that has a random... Chance. Um, I have an incredible copy of Shadow of the Beast for uh, the Turbo Duo oh, Psygnosis yeah. game with the Psygnosis full oh, on God. music. I remember that. So game. good. Um, oh. okay, so after that first you beat the toe at the end. That's where you, the last guys that flip. I remember that. Yep. So good. That game is insane. Okay, this sucks. Already. Okay, everybody talking about uh, Metal Slug right now. How they cut. Weapons out from the American version, from the Japanese version. Uh, they cut out the chainsaw dude from Zombies Ate My Neighbors in some versions. Oh yeah, that's great. This is the worst. I hate this boss. <laughs> Just the idea of punching this knife. Do not. Ooh, oh, just look. Nice! Bam! Nice! You iked it. Oh! oh. Right now you iked it. Right through the shin. I did. I did. <laughs> Pull the knife. We Ryan iked it straight up. Yes. <laughs> yes, always. Always. Yes. always. always. <laughs> This is uh, not my favorite video game soundtrack. No. <laughs> it's pretty brutal. It's, I mean, it, it puts in a space, man. Mount <laughs> Red Gaming says, So, curious, what did Adam cook that I should be jealous of? He's making a uh, vegetable stew and a beef stew right now. Beef barley. Smelling beef incredible. barley stew. Oh my god, that sounds so good. It's going to be so good to eat, and then we're going to go to the airlock. You guys are going to meet us at the airlock, with at least one of you, right? Um... You know, my friend that said he wishes he could be at the airlock after Googling it, he disappeared from the stream. So he maybe. may have decided, I'm just going to drive up to Seattle tonight. Where Where is he? Uh, he's okay. in Portland. Okay. All right. So he, drive, he drives real fast. Yeah, it's two and a half, three hours. Yeah. yeah. Now, now they're talking about how Contra was turned into Probotector. Yeah. True. In the European version. Probotector. <laughs> we both did the same thing. Probotector. Adam, what are you in your what's in your stews? Vegetables, veggies, veggies, delicious meat, delicious meat. Are you allergic to anything? Gluten. Really? It's the only thing. Oh. I mean, I ate before I came. It's not. Well, it's not a. I'm just asking out of curiosity. We we can avoid putting the barley in. Oh, Jack of Day says. Uh, Carmageddon changed, uh, the zombies into robots. What? <laughs> I, I eat it's worth it to me. Okay, gotcha. It's, it doesn't. Like, it's so delicious, I don't it mind shitting for... Okay, you know, God, I may or may not plan Jesus. a summer trip to come see Adam, <laughs> or have him come down to Galloping Ghost. Galloping Ghost is amazing. He keeps oh. mentioning Galloping Ghost, and I have no idea what it is. It's, the nor it's North me. America's... Oh, I'm not supposed to say He it. won't tell me, and he told me not to Google it. Mel Kevin and Gaming, am I not supposed to tell about, a Gall about Galloping Ghost? That's a good name. I like that name. And then after you get your response to the question. No, he's fine. It just takes time. Yeah. yeah. Nice. Nice. Just stand, just stand. Ooh, whoa! Oh! Oh, you got oh. this. Oh, you got this. Oh! Oh! Oh yeah! Oh jeez. 
face. Fuck a picture. Fuck a picture. Yep, yep. Yeah! Nice. Max. Did you do it? Was the ghost? And I think that's the ghost that'll chase you. Okay. Oh! 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 You got fucked. Sick that's, move. That's Sick move. That's game. That's incredible. Who's, Who's the designer? Huh. That, no, that, that was... That was the right kind of stupid. That no, was, but like, if that's your last hit point and you die, you have to do it all real. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Well, that's good. Words. I don't know if you've played I Want to Be the Guy. <laughs> that game does that times a thousand. Arcadian Gaming says, oh, I mean, it's the best okay. place in the world, go ahead, it's the Disneyland of arcade games. It's, it's, it's North America's largest uh, arcade game, or arcade, like, functional arcade. Um, okay, that's incredible. It's, it's the best. It's got 400 games. Ooh! And Jesus! <laughs> well, hell! Did you die? There's I don't hell. remember that at all! Oh, now you're in hell. Good job. Wait, 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 why is this different? What? It just it didn't oh, kill it, us. Oh, it actually pulled you down. down. Yeah. So Sezoe has a question. Oh, uh, God, it, it also, oh you pay 15 God, bucks. Huh? You pay 15 bucks, and it's everything to be fine. Oh, nice. You just go. See, I, I completely forgot what you had said there for a second. <laughs> like, what's 15? And I'm like, what am I paying 15 dollars for? Oh. Sezoe has a question. Star Maze of Staff. So technically, the Helix Commander that you fight in the shoot 'em up mode can be the same person you interact with in the adventure portion of the game as an NPC, correct? This is correct. <laughs> <laughs> no, no further information. This is correct. No, I answered the question. It was a direct question. I answered it directly. So fucking funny, guys. You usually just go on all these tangents about Oh, yeah. No, he doesn't shoot up ever. And, and then just hearing it, this yes. is correct. <laughs> You just fell into a fucking bamboo pit and died. This is... Why? She's loving your hair. What's up? Oh, her name's Bitwise. Her name's Bitwise. So, so far we're oh, seeing Scuzzy and Bitwise. Yeah, Lilo is hiding. Lilo is hiding. Beck is not allowed. Throw the rock. Yeah. It spit on me. Did the Beck didn't. That's a pew. She's not fat, she's big belly. No, I can do it. Guys, we're here for your whole set. He gets to watch a live stream of China Warriors next. We have China Warriors. You want to see that shit? It'll happen. Oh, look at double chainsaw arm to arm. Double chainsaw arm. Shoot him. Yeah, you. I love that he's got a sack on his head. Double chainsaw arms that are made of raspberries. Raspberry chainsaw arms. You know, two kids walking into the mansion was too violent, but not. Not this. So close. It was. Now we have a key ball. It's time uh, for the third. Oh, I don't want to play. Point? I don't want to play. Okay, then gaming says 446 oh, games now. And the pinball room. Yeah. When I was last there, they had a really awesome um, modern play gameplay room as well. And they're making a, a fighter. A uh, old school frame-by-frame uh, uh, -frame photo style oh, fighter. God. Where, um... Uh, the, the actual Galloping Ghost is making a uh, 2D fighter with um, Mortal Kombat style sprites that are made from uh, or digitizing, people? digitizing people. Do but they have? Do they have Killer Queen? Look, <gasps> it's the best game ever. Darth Vader says, "I don't need to see China Warrior ever again." Yes. Ah, it's well because there's only no, like we a have couple it. of those machines. I also have I know, um, I know they're Ninja Spirit, which is fucking country, one of the greatest games ever made. made. Okay. Uh, one of them is down at Ground Control in Portland. Really? Yeah, they that's just got it. I want to say if you want to. That's awesome because that's the best game ever. Do you guys like Ninja Spirit? I loved Ninja Spirit. I had Ninja Spirit. It's so good. I. It's so good. G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G G Darth Vader says, dude, Ninja Spirit, I remember GamePro Magazine gave it a perfect 10. Ninja Spirit yeah, is incredible. So it's incredible. realize you were done eating. It's one of the best games ever made. I haven't played this game since I was 14. It's a bit wise at years. They're all, they're all girls. They're all girls. I live in a world. I live in a world of ladies. When I picked her up, I was like, "Oh, you're heavier than I thought you were." She's not fat. She's just big appetite. She she has big bones. 
And so her bones are perfectly normal size. She just has a giant stomach. <laughs> She's lost a lot of she weight. She doesn't have a giant stomach. She has big fat pads. She's used to be way bigger, and she's lost a lot of weight, and she's doing very well. Good job. Oh, he changes his arc. Yeah. Very friendly and cute. Yeah. Oh, my God, watch this. Wait, how did you enter? If I turned up, I turned up uh, turbo all the way up. Yeah. Oh, he's just, he's just starting the animation <laughs> over and over he's again. Hitting it. Yeah, but it's so fast that it just yeah. spins. It's fascinating. Oh yeah, look at that. Into your Turbo level stance. 2. Oh, that... Keep that. That's one thing I always loved about those controllers. You could change the turbo level. And yeah, built in. the yeah. Turbo Duo was the only system ever to launch with uh, turbo buttons as stock. For the turbo graphics. For turbo pads. pads. Duo pads and turbo pads. I'm trying to speak every time you try to speak. <laughs> the best <laughs> part of the, <laughs> the best part of Metal Gear Solid 1 was when Revolver Ocelot tapped you so he was like, don't use turbo, we all know. It's the best. It's the best. You guys don't. You guys don't. There, you guys don't. there are a few so games good. that you would Watch, watch the hand, jump! Control. Jump over that shit. Jump, jump over that shit. Dark Rooker says, anyone remember Platypus? Jump! jump. Yeah! Yes. Oh, 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 it's a claymation side scroll truck. Cool. Is it recent or old? No, it's it's older. I don't know that. Um, they just put it on Steam. Oh. And I just I mean probably about six out. minutes ago. We should we should actually get platypus and give it a shot. Well, let's play platypus on on the show. And this man says, the "City I live in is insane. Banned arcade machines oh. outside of bars, so now now no one has any." Dude, you just lay laid into him. Yeah, one hit left. Just oh, fucking shit. let him have it. I love the breakdance you do. Oh, that's the cheapest. You part. is out of failure, sir. <laughs> awesome. Why don't you get in here and get in the game? One minute. Get in the game. He is. I love that. It makes me sad they don't do that. I uh, I made fun of that mo motivational growth. There's a character called the the uh, the games genie. Yeah. Who okay. goes, get back in the game! Everything's about get in, getting in the game because get in the game is grammatically incorrect and I find it very hilarious and stupid. When people say get in the game, it sounds ridiculous. So, I uh, make fun of that a lot. Get back in the game. He got in the game! It is a funny thing. I don't think anybody gets the joke. It's my joke. It's for you. Adam, I thought you were going to be our savior. I thought I was too. I didn't realize you were going to be our favorite. I, I think we, we just need to be kick sliding through him. Now they're oh, also talking about God, other great slide. shmups that they love, like R Type Delta 2, Einhander. Do, do us a favor, guys. Send the shmups that you want us to examine or perhaps play um, to social at starmazer.com. Thunder Force 5. Thunder Force 5 is incredible. Right in 2. Right in 2 is awesome. So please send us those as a list. To uh to social at starmazer.com. We will uh we'll try to play as many as we can, obviously. Oh my god, that smells so good. Doesn't this smell incredible? We need to stream this. Melcavian Gaming, I'm a, I'm gonna be all up in your atom eating your stew. Melcavian Gaming says Salamander 2. That sounds a little Nope, it sounds exactly how I wanted it to sound. Okay. Salamander 2 is amazing. I wanna play um I wanna play Phalanx. Isn't that the one with like the like the farmer on the front cover? Yeah. Are you zoning Why is he right now? jumping at you? Because he's zoning him. Didn't you pay, didn't you notice? He only jumped at a certain a certain distance from him. So I, I guess it's not just the final boss that's completely randomized. Dude, he's got he, he's got an attack for your town. Yeah, I know. You're gonna try to figure out the hack, right? Ray Crisis! It says trip time. Oh. That was intense. Bro. Austin, you were working it. That was he was, every time we got here, he was watching. You could see him kick over. And he's like, I don't know. He's Soul to Dream says Sapphire. It's, it, it's interesting. Go ahead. Go again. Watch people who we'll go for it. understand the mechanics uh -huh. looking at things yeah. and then coming in and knowing what to do. I've never played this game. Well, of course. That, 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 that's why you were watching. Dude, that, I don't know how to defeat that wolf. It always takes two hearts. Definitely. Okay. It was worse. The gun sucks. Like you can't, you know, shoot down. Yeah, you, you can't can. do it. Crouch shoots. 
I mean, why would you? Oh, so if, if you kill the green guys, the wolf will come and start chomping on the meat they Only if you shotgun them, though. Like, I want to get rid of the shotgun. It's worse. <laughs> jump, is... jump those, jump those. No. You were gonna he get jumped it, you just took them off. Axelay says Citizen Cybertron. Axelay is great. That's a beautiful game. Now, Gaming Gaming has sent us an email. I saw it just now. I, I was wondering if he would, because he has a lot of things he loves. Thank you, Malkavian Gaming. What's our What's our pledge at right now? Uh, 127.658. 127.658, guys. We're going for 155, so everybody gets audio cassettes. Um, and actually, once we hit um, 168, we will be at 80% of our goal. 168? Yeah. You're 138? 128? Sorry. What are you saying? What, what words are you saying? 128. 128. 80% 128, we're 80% there. Oh, so we're pretty oh, good to 80% there with we'll seven see. days in our seven days to go area. So nice. that's yes. pretty that's pretty solid, guys. Remember though, dudes, we absolutely need to make that first stretch goal if we want to hire all those cool musicians. Uh we also we also really want to get those console stretch goals, guys. Don't forget about the pog. I'm gonna I'm gonna pog. tell you something I'm not I'm probably not even ever supposed to say. If we hit those console stretch goals. I can go to a publisher with consoles on lockdown, and then we can really make this this game rock. If I go to publishers and they have to cover the consoles, then we, we lose a lot of our, our ground, a lot of our stance. So, do me the favor. Hit the stretch goals. Yeah, one. Oh. Oh. Alright, let us belt. Dude, there's probably an article about how to beat this guy in some prep magazine. I'm sure there is. Oh, he reminds me of the chainsaw guys with the bags over their heads in Resident Evil 5. Or no, 4. Or Resident Evil I'm pretty 4. sure those are based on him. Garth Wickfield says, Armed Police Batrider by Raising. No? I'll do it. Oh, it's fine. I can't, I can't remember who the controller got handed on to. I'm watching, I'm looking around your uh, beautiful locks. <laughs> says you, it says, I still say Star Major Pog minigame would be amazing. Or amusing. I agree with you, says Zway. NS Man says, wait until after he swiped with the chainsaw before you attack. What was that? He says, wait until after he swiped with the chainsaw to attack. NS Man. No, no, no. Careful. Now, Gaming Gaming says, I just tweeted out to the current record holder of Splatterhouse. Hopefully, he, she stops by the stream to tell you guys a thing or two. That's cool. Yeah. Uh, Rupert is out. We need to see that. Oh. Uh, you say, someone else is out. Doing it. Darth Rupert is out. Yeah, he's leaving. Have a good night. Bye, there. Darth, Bye, Darth Rupert. Bye. Thanks for joining us. Oh. Are we from the top? Are we from the fucking we have, motherfucking we have to stop. top? We can't handle this game. We anymore. just got tore up! A from the flow up! <laughs> oh, yeah. man. Are you playing or not? I can't. We are. I can't handle this game. Oh, are we going to move on oh, to uh, NES version soon? NES uh, Friday the 13th? We can do that. That, that game is... <laughs> Friday the 13th. That game is We're going to do it. We got it. has We're some play. fantastic music. Not I, uh, really, but it's... Hold on, you're tore up from the motherfucking flow up. I played that a bit as a kid, and it confused me a lot. It yeah, it's, it's, it's still confuse me. It's, it's a lot of just moving into specific houses at very precise times. But there's apparently a way you can kill Jason like immediately. I forget how you do it. Can I tell you something? I only played Friday the 13th on NES one time. And I didn't understand it. I was a little kid. So you get, this most is gonna people. be. This is gonna be. Uh, I don't moment. think any of us will understand. Yeah, well, I know. Austin seems to know. I know if you go no, on no, the water and play the little. Trip time has cool. a big explanation. One of the best strategies against this version of the Biggie Man is the shotgun juggle, where Rick moves forward while swapping both shotguns until reaching the Biggie Man. Both oh, shotguns. Wow. 
Um, if an enemy crosses the player's path, use the kick attacks to deal with them, pressing down and kick. While in the air, allows Rick to jump kick while holding a weapon. Use one shotgun on the Binky Man until it's empty, and then finish him off with the second one. Rick's sliding kick is also a good attack if you run out of shotgun shells. You just got asshole butt leached. I did. But how do you get two shotguns? There are two in the level. Yeah, there are two shotguns in the level. I know There's got to be a way to drop the shotgun yeah. so you cannot use it against enemies. That's no, you're, right. you're, or you're just double fisting. It, it, no, it suggested using um, kicks, jump kicks and um, side kicks. Oh, so you carry it all. What? Right slide kick? I didn't know yeah. about that. Yeah, slide kick. You go. Oh, you know, you're trying to get it. It's, it's a not quite frame perfect. It's and super hard. Says, have you guys tried Soul Force or Soul Feast? No. I have not. Never heard of it. Uh. <laughs> you don't know. Oh, fuck. Just duck in the middle. It was a group effort. We all did this. Stupid. You're in turbo? So you can just turbo level two. Yeah. No time. No time. <laughs> no time. I want the manual though. control. You gotta feel the road. Oh, yeah, I stood up and punched that one. That was a good, was a good call. Yeah, I think that one just bails out. He's like, fuck no. But, he's, but then this one. <laughs> no. I think the speedrun record for this game is about 14 minutes. What? I don't think we'll make it. I don't think we're I'm going, going for it. However, I am currently trying to get the uh, world record in Willow. Yeah. Willow is hard. Yes. The controls were like yes. dicks. Mm. Okay. I never played that. This, this, I wanna. This is a great Sarmies or Phoenix. Fur, 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 fur. I think this one needs to win a contest. Fur, fur, fur. I'm gonna submit one and I'll get It'll be a remix of this and it'll be worse. Yeah, I'll mash up. Splatter Mazer. Splatter Mazer. It's what everyone wants. Splatter Mazer. Star House. Star House. Splatter Star Mazer House. I want to Splatter House. US. Yeah. Splatter House. Splatter House. Yes. I want to make a mod for this game called Splatter House. And it's just, it's dead mouse music pumping and blasting. That and you just replace the mask better. with the dead mouse mask. Oh, that's... Raw hack. Yeah. And there, there are no enemies, just like tweaked out ravers. Yeah. You gotta, you have to get your way through the scene groupies. <laughs> Guys, I can't take this game. <laughs> Dude, you're nailing it. I know, that's the problem. Dominating. The worse the game gets, the better, right. the better <laughs> cash. Oh, oh, Jesus. Ah, oh, you got wrecked! That you couldn't a, handle it! That is a true statement. I like that you picked the, the board back up, though. I'm excellent at deadly premonition. <laughs> excellent. You're also great at footbag. Footbag? Excellent footbag. Yeah. California Games footbag. Footbag. Legendary sport. I was excellent at the surfing, too, but the game refused to acknowledge it. Dude, California Games surfing is legit. Let's not even pretend. I was I was a genius I, at legit it. Legit is not the word I would use. It's I was good. born amazing at it, it's and good. the game Shut refuses up. to acknowledge me. Frankie from Florida asks, have you played Bonk's Revenge? I, I own Bonk's Adventure, Bonk's Revenge, and Bonk's Big Revenge. Uh, or Bonk's Big Adventure, rather. I do not own Box Big Adventure on Super CD, which is a desire of mine. But I have played the living hell out of those games. Yes, absolutely, I have played those games. I love those games. Oh. Middle, dude. Uh. Oh! oh! Nice. Oh, you're trying to do the Atom. No, I'm trying to hit him. Remember, that picture frame's gonna come off and be a complete asshole. Here he comes, get out of the way. He's gonna be a complete jerk. No. Nope. Uh, Nabde! I can't see. I can't. This... Go again, go again. Oh, oh we're out of lives. This is the worst. What the fuck? I don't want, to I don't want your future! This music. Ba, 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 this is why you guys ba, need to ba, back ba, Star Mazer ba, ba, to get those music, all those amazing music to, people on. To not make it so can, can that sounds like a billion Star Mazer. Just make sure he doesn't actually get a real copy. Just send him a build that has this. This music. Music. Oh, that'd be so good. I would yeah. stream it. <laughs> Big guys, here's Star Mazer, the real version. Yeah. <laughs> Got early leaks. 
<laughs> that's the next title. That's gotta be the thing. Like, if you don't have a code or whatever, if it, it's verified a pirate version, it just plays the Slaughterhouse. <laughs> oh, that would be fantastic. Slaughterhouse music. It, it's just Slaughterhouse music. Yeah, jump. Don't want to tip the ladder. I don't want your ladder. I, guys, I keep this music. I can't. Why? <laughs> it just gets faster as you get through this. And level. higher pitched. And higher pitched. Yes, art. <laughs> If Jacob Purnell's walking watching, I'd like to know if this music is prog. <laughs> sounds kinda of froggy. It sounds kinda of froggy to me. That's me. I, actually as as a special teacher of prog. I, I teach prog rock to people. Oh. This is the okay. definition. <laughs> <laughs> Can you give us that definition? Nope, let's not do it. Let's not do this. Really? This that's, is a bad, this is a bad this is the definition. That's good. That's a good answer. I, I, let's, we're not doing that. In the dictionary, it says C Splatterhouse. We're not getting into the prog thing. I can't Sorry, do it. Man. I can't do it. Oh, God. I don't listen to a So, what are you doing right now? You're fighting bottles. Playing the worst game. Because <laughs> it's so mediocre. And that just. It's, it's getting to me. It's an amazing game. It's just it's a horrible. We're fighting a chair right now. Horrible. It's horrible. It was an amazing game. Well, Soft, it just came says, Oh, yeah, Splatterhouse. Splatterhouse! We're actually going to be jumping away from Splatterhouse and on to Friday the 13th. Well, the I NES. never thought I'd say Friday the 13th, I'm going to pull a great hand my nipples. We're going to take that in a minute. Did you say I love my nipples? I said, and my nipples are great, and I, I love my nipples. I'm going to all psyched out now. Trip that ass. Stupid knives will punch you. Triptide asks, will there be inside jokes inside Star Mace are the kind to make the player really laugh? Yes, absolutely, Triptide. That's a, a, a major part of, <laughs> part of Star Mazer is, is inside jokes, hints, uh, <laughs> Easter eggs, all kinds of cool stuff. As well as a nice, it's dramatic, deeply bad, well told story. But it's not, it's like, it's still like, like it's, it's, it's right, right there. there. So you're like, right you, wanna keep, you don't want to keep playing, but you do, because you're like, well, I'll, I'll get it next exactly. time. Exactly. And it psychs me out. Yeah. It makes me worse every time. Yeah. Because it's getting in my head. So, Rob, like you said this, this link here. Yeah, that never would happen. On this is an Excel spreadsheet. Nice. That's incredible. Rafa, do us a favor. Send an email to social at starmazer.com describing us for us how exactly to do that. <laughs> how to set that up so that we can have people submit. Rafa's awesome. Oh, Rafa's amazing. Yeah. Alright, we're gonna take five minutes, guys. Oh, oh, no, 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 you gotta play through this. You gotta play through this. Oh. Ah! Yes! Oh, yes! Here, kill it! Kill it all! Yeah, fuck you! Trip yeah. Diet says, no nipple jokes, though, Don. Oh, Too late. No it's nipple sweaty. jokes. Like That's not fair. Because this, this is the Isn't worst. And we were just yeah. most just, into it, though. Oh, nice chair. That was a good, that was a good chair juggle. Yeah. Fuck you, knife. Oh, you think you're so clever. Yep. Oh, right in your belly. You got belly knife. That's fine. Right in your tum-tum. It was worth it. I call it a tum-tum, too. Tum-tum, too, too. Sorry, end of the game. No, right? don't continue. No, Five minutes, guys. Gone. We're going to change over our technology. We'll be back with the NES version of my nipples. Oh, yeah. Yes. Yes, Friday the 13th. I you really love wish it. You, wouldn't do that. you love it so much. I actually really like this. I'm pretty thrilled. I mean, it keeps That's doing it. They're getting harder. Yeah, that happens. They're getting as hard as Friday the 13th for the NES. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see you guys in five minutes!